love my parents. I wouldn't ever want to do a thing to hurt them. But I love the rest of my family, starting with my wife. And by the way, she's seated here this evening, mashallah. Now you know why I said all of that. But my brothers and sisters, to be very honest with you, may Allah Almighty grant us goodness. Pray to Allah to help you eradicate bad habits and develop good habits. Let there be something unique about you. We're talking here. It's a motivational evening. And I'm going to tell you that Wallahi, I need to work on myself and so do you. Become a better person. How can you get married? And then after some time, you say, but I'm only going out with my friends. No, my brother, it's wrong. Those are all bachelors. And if one or two of them are married, they have marital problems. They are also facing a disaster. Their spouses are telling them, how do you like it? For example, sorry, let me finish that sentence. Their spouses are telling them the same thing. How would you like it if it was the other way around? Your wife went out every night up to two and three in the morning and decided, I'm just with my friends. What are you doing? Shisha, hookah, whatever they call it, right? And by the way, the flavor was quite nice. You would have liked it if you were there, right? Imagine, what would you do if it was the other way around? Unacceptable. If it is unacceptable that way, it is unacceptable this way. Thank you very much. So why, why on earth did you get married? You have no time for your kids. You have no patience with them and you call yourself connected to Allah. You call yourself a believer. You're a Muslim. You're a mu'min. You should be ashamed of yourself. May Allah protect us. Go and spend more time there. Do what's right. Your life is short. You will die before you know you're going to die. Has anyone known I'm going to die tomorrow morning, eight o'clock? That's it. I'm going. Goodbye. No, you die without all of that. You're gone. And that's it. You don't want to regret it. Allah has blessed you with a faith that governs every aspect of your life. If only you understand.